Alright, welcome back to Bowser's Valley. I had a video finishing the castle, but... Oh, crap. But it seems to have gotten lost somehow. And I don't... I don't know where it would be, so... I'm just gonna redo it from where I left off. Where I think I left off. Ah, damn it. Come on. I blame the slowdown. I'm mostly at fault, but I blame the slowdown. So I know it's coming up, but... Oh, hey. Ooh, leaf thingy. Delicious. Oh, you get like a free mushroom when you get an item. That's sort of glitchy. Well, it's the original game's behavior, but... I think, at least, that means you would get an extra health. For like no reason. Ow. You get an extra death for no reason. That always happens, though. More slowdown even in Bowser's castle. In my opinion, he should chill with the um, the jumping fireball dudes. So they're like everywhere, and they seem to really add to the slowdown. They don't add too much obstacle. Whoa! Unlike those, which add good obstacle-ness. They're high in obstacle-ness. And protein. Ooh, is this Bowser's door? I honestly forget, but it looks like it might be. I wonder if both doors go to the same place. Yeah, it sounds like Bowser. Okay, they both go to the same place. It's ba- oh. It's you! It's the uh, Hammer siblings. I get that name from Doc Sigma, I'm pretty sure. I was watching him play uh, Mario 3 hacks. Which, if you've ever seen them, Pretty much, the way to make a Super Mario Bros. 3 hack is to just get an editor, copy and paste all of the Hammer Brothers everywhere and every level, and there's your hack. And this is Bowser. Look how lame this is, honestly. That's what you do. That Bowser was stupid in Mario 1. That Bowser is even more stupid now. It's the classic Bowser, but it's stupidly easy. You just run right through him. But I don't think there was an actual ending in the game normally, but that's fine because I hate sitting through the credits again. Anyway, I know there is an extra exit here, but the problem is... Ow. I can't get to that exit without the green switch. And I don't know where the green switch is. None of the remaining levels are marked with a red, except I missed one, but it doesn't lead to the the red switch. I guess the only hint I have is that castle is still intact. I think most of them collapsed. I'm not sure if that's like intentional though. It may just be a, that's probably a glitch. But I see there's a path untraveled up there, but I have no idea how I would get to that. There's no real indication of that. So I'm thinking back in here, there may be some extra exit somewhere, because that... You can see the level, like, 4 area, the Choco Land thing from here, but there are no red levels that I missed. I was thinking maybe it was the Ghost House, but I'm pretty sure I looked in here and there wasn't an apparent secret exit. I'll look again off-camera, but I'm pretty sure there isn't. And if there is it should really be noted somehow because I'm pretty sure that none of the other ghost houses have had secret exits oh yeah I remember this level I'm pretty sh yeah it definitely only has one exit so I really have absolutely no idea what I missed if you've played the hack and or know where the green freaking switch is please let me know so I can finish the hack completely but I missed something in here. There was that switch that confused the hell out of me. I finally figured that out, what that did. The arrows were lies. That's that's all, about, all I remember. Which I was not very happy about that, honestly, but I lost my fire. Mario can't burn things anymore. 
slide very slowly. I guess you can't slide as fast when you're holding stuff. That's interesting. Ah! Stupid shell. And those micro goombas, yet again, are way too obvious. I think that's what they're called. Oh ho! Hey, I killed that thing. I didn't know you could do that. More munchers. These things. Like, if somebody knows what SMW enemy does the, like, die and flop over thing, I'd really like to know, because I know I've seen that, like, effect before. No idea what it is, though. Or the friggin' invisible block thingies, I hate those. In any context. It doesn't matter if it's, like, helping me, I still hate it. Uh, here's the pipe. Where's that P-switch? I know there's a P-switch somewhere. I think I went past it. I'm pretty sure I went past it. Oh, it's in here. I forgot to do the uh, thingy. There we go. Now, if you hit the switch, it says go this way! Yay! Coins! Arrows! Uh, blocks you can't apparently break. And there's this thing, and it seems like you can go in that pipe. You can't. It's a friggin' lie. It's more of a lie than the cake. Or the pie, or whatever dessert treat you prefer. Anyway. Damn it. That was dumb. Let's activate it here. Yeah, you can go into this pipe. And there are arrows pointing to it, but... Well, there's one arrow. But it doesn't seem like you can do... Aw, oh, crap. I need that... I needed that flame thingy. I'll be back. Now let's do this the right way. Damn it. Now let's do this the right way. There you go. I could have saved myself a little trouble if I had remembered I need that stupid thing, but... I just rewound to the part of the level when I had it. Is that a word? Rewound? Rewinded? I gone and done rewounded, y'all. Mysterious cave. This didn't used to be unlocked, but I unlocked it on camera and lost the footage. And I was really, really hoping this would be the green switch thingy. Spoiler, it's not. In fact, I have no idea why this is a secret at all. If you noticed, it's just a roundabout path to the pyramid, which we went to anyway. So it's just like an alternate way, which I guess is sort of neat, but it's fairly hard to get for just an alternate path. Like, considering the whole trickster arrow dealies and needing a fire flower, I would expect, oh hey, I'm gonna get a switch palace. But no, I just get lies and fire. I don't, I don't like either of those, okay? Stop sending me fire on my birthday. I don't like it. I appreciate the thought, but no. Oh, pipe maze, delicious. Tastes like confusion. And death. I've noticed a lot of things taste like death lately. Probably see a doctor about that. Oh well, spider creature. Die. Oh hey, you can uh, spin on the sidey ones. Not sure what I was trying to say there. Halfway point. Let's go get this daily. Yeah, I can definitely make that without this. Oh wait, what's down here? Oh, it's death. That's what's usually down there. Alright, can I use this for a secret? Because you definitely didn't need it to get over that gap. Yay! I got an arrow, or uh, a coin. Ow. Secret or death? Death. It's always death. It's never lupus, but it is always death. Wow. Well, that was lucky. Wait, I can't use this at all. 
Oh, that's lame. I think I remember that from before, though. I remember coming up to the stupid arrow thing and be like, what the hell? WTF, mate. Whoa! What was that? <laughs> that's pretty cool. Damn it. Come on, Mario. Be more ninja. Mario comes from a long line of Italian ninjas. And those... These wood blocks are really hard to see on this background. Just thought I would note that. Oh, is this like a... Oh, no, it's not. thought this was a splitting path. I keep looking for secrets, but... I'm really sure there isn't... There aren't any in this level, because... It's yellow. And the hacker has been good with marking red levels, but... There's just no indication of where the hell that yellow, that green switch is. Oh, and it's Mr. Sun again. Damn it. Why do you hate me, Mr. Sun? Well, fortunately, you're staying oddly in place despite the world moving. Well, I guess that's because he's so far away. That's perfectly normal. It's perfectly not normal is when he suddenly comes down and attacks you, and it turns out the sun is like two feet wide. That was sort of a disappointment. Why are you so angry, Mr. Sun? Are you off your pills again? Oh, crap. I didn't mean it. It was just a joke. Well, I pissed off Mr. Sun. That's great. Can I kill you? No, I don't think I can. It'd be really bad if you kill the sun with a shell. Ow. Not sure I will rewound. Rewinded it. Alright, those don't give you anything, do they? That's so weird that he, like, goes all squiggly when you fall and he's moving. See? It's, like, squiggly. Ah! See, I keep thinking I'm gonna get hit, but I don't. Go on, fire thingy. He always stays, like, pretty much below the terrain, so it's not really that harmful. See? I don't think I even could have been hit at that point. Okay, you definitely can't have the sun. At least he's not, like, being very aggressive. Well, he's being aggressive, but he's not being very effective, so... That's nice. I destroyed the sun. That's always worth a laugh. And it just brings you back to the friggin' pyramid. Which... I'm definitely sure that doesn't have a secret exit, because it's, like, all boxed in. And level 2... Level 2 had a thing. A switch. This has a switch on the map, at least. I'm thinking it must be in World 4? But I have no idea where it would be. It's either in World 4... Or, like, some roundabout way from World 2. I tried looking it, it up in Lunar Magic. So I could, like, look at the maps. But the file's locked. Which I can respect that, but... I shouldn't have to try and look at your maps to figure out what the hell I'm supposed to even do. But anyway, it was a pretty good hack, even if I can't figure out what the hell... But yeah, if anyone knows where the green switch is, please let me know in a comment or whatever.